is it all. Ohio State repeats as Big Ten champions after the 45-24 victory over Northwestern. It wasn't the prettiest of wins, but it was a victory. And a win that Dwayne Haskins, breaking his own single-game passing record for Ohio State, cemented his status as a serious Heisman Trophy candidate. I hit the pose, didn't I? I think I should be there. <laughs> the kid's amazing, man. We all knew it from day one, you know, just you know, watching him work, you know, and I told him after the game, he's, he's becoming, he's become a man. You know, at first he was a little immature, you know, he had to work to some things and, he, and he's done it, you know. You know, everything isn't going to be perfect, but, you know, you have to step up to the plate, you know, be different. He, he's, he's been different all season. Man, he's unreal. I can't, I can't even explain. Uh, all due respect to him, he's probably the best I ever played with. You know, that, that kid, he never fails to impress. Uh, he's, he, he gets better. Um, game by game, and you know, once when you he, you think he's he's done it all, he he surprises you with something else. Um, so, I mean, it's it's amazing what he's done. I mean, he's blessed, he's gifted, um, he's a great player for sure. He's gotten better. I feel like each and every each and every game. Um, I'm so proud of his leadership. Um, from the games like TCU where we had some tough on the road games to now he's composing our offense, he's composing our defense, and. Um, you just want to see that in a first-year starter. You almost forget that he's a first-year quarterback at a place like Ohio State. Um, it comes with a lot of responsibility. I felt like he's ha handled it well. You go up against Dwayne every day in practice. Is what we saw today what you see every day in practice? Or did he even take it another level? Yeah, I mean, he's incredible. I mean, the talent that he has with his arm and his skill and how smart he is, um, it all shows in practice and obviously it shows in the game as well. He's just incredible talent um, and it's just, he is who he is. So. So the Buckeyes headed to Pasadena to take on Washington. And for those concerned that the Buckeyes won't be able to get up for the Rose Bowl after missing out on the college football playoffs, players say that will not be an issue. Um, if we end up in the Rose Bowl, this team's going to give everything that we have. Uh, you know, we're not going to be, um, you know, we're not going to hang our heads over it. We're going to stand high and prepare the right way and go win the Rose Bowl. Uh, obviously, we want to play for it all, but that's the granddaddy of them all as well. You know, as a little kid, I always wanted to play in the Rose Bowl, so I won't have a long face. Um, it's my last game playing as a Buckeye, too, so I'm going to make sure we're prepared, and I have no doubt that our team's going to give it all we got. Back-to-back yeah. -back Big Ten champions. How does that sound? Um, sounds great. About the, I'm on the ring committee. I'm going to make sure we get a big ring, a big one. I feel like we, we've accomplished our goal. Our goal at the beginning of the year was to get the Indy and all the extra stuff was going to come, but I feel like we got the Indy and I get another one of these back-to-back. -back. So the hot questions between now and the bowl game will be how many of Ohio State's underclassmen, including Dwayne Haskins, will declare themselves eligible for the NFL draft, and what is Urban Meyer's future? Now, after the game, Shelly Meyer did say Urban's been feeling a lot better the several weeks and that winning is a terrific cure. In Indy, Mark Kuntz, BCSN. Ohio State has a ring committee. Why am I not surprised? The case for Haskins to Heisman is nothing short of a good one. The voting for Heisman winner ends tomorrow. That's right. The finalists will be announced tomorrow after voting ends, and the Heisman Trophy presentation will take place on December 8th in New York City, airing on ESPN at 8 p.m. The other candidates with the best chances of becoming the finalists include Alabama's Tua Tunga Viola, Oklahoma's Kyler Murray, and West Virginia's Will Greer.